Hello friends, welcome back to Best Way to Study. In this video, we are going to see few important topics with uh, help of which you can easily crack TCS of Campus Drive 2019 exam. So recently, that is on 23rd of August 2019, the registration for this particular TCS of, of Campus Exam Drive uh, has been closed. So exam is going to be start started, like exam is going to be commenced on 1st of September 2019. So now let's see what are the most important topics which you can prepare so that you can easily crack this particular exam. So coming to this particular exam, there are four important sections uh, which are mandatory. There are four different sections uh, for this particular exam. Coming to the pattern details, uh, there are four different sections. The first section is that You'll be having questions for Eng from English and then quantitative aptitude and coming to the third section you'll be having questions regarding the programming concepts all theory and the fourth uh, last but not least you'll be having questions coming from coding where you need to code and you need to get the output in order to get uh, marks uh, from this particular uh, last section okay. So now let's see what are the important topics which you can concentrate coming to aptitude. Aptitude is the first section coming to aptitude. Please concentrate on the topics which I am going to tell you in this video. So coming to aptitude, please concentrate on number system. It is one of the most important topic, uh, no, most important section where uh, you can score most of the marks. So please uh, concentrate on number system time speed and distance coming to time speed and uh, distance the medium to difficult level uh, of questions will be asked coming to the time speed and distance they may ask you time and speed or speed and distance or time and distance so better to prepare all the three and then please concentrate on percentages okay percentages are very important like this question uh, one to two questions will be asked coming to the percentages and uh, coming to the next important topic profit and loss it's very important basic questions will be asked so coming to the quantitative aptitude if you are thorough with the formulae you can attempt 90 percent of quantitative aptitude paper only the standard formula should always be in your mind uh, please follow the standard book in order to crack the questions from quantitative aptitude uh, and then most, uh, most and more important topics coming to the quantitative aptitude are concentrate on series. Okay, coming to series, they may ask you alphanumeric series or alphabetic series or numeric series. Uh, so it's there which they may ask you any kind of questions coming to series. So coming to series, they may ask you two kind of different questions. First type is like two types of different questions. First type is they may give you a series and they may ask you what is the number which which is going to come next in the given series. Okay. And coming to the type 2 question which they may ask you coming to series is they'll ask you what is the wrong number or um, what is the wrong number which is uh, which appeared in the series. Okay. Uh, such kind of they wonderly will give you the wrong number in the given series and they'll ask you to find out the wrong number which is given in the series okay so series is also very important and then concentrate on clocks and calendars also okay they are also very important okay so coming to quantitative aptitude as i said please follow the standard book from which you can get the standard formulae and uh, make sure you maintain a short notes of the uh, important formulae coming to the quantitative aptitude so that you can easily crack the particular quantitative aptitude section okay so coming to English uh, what you need to do is uh, you will be having questions such as sentence improvement which are very 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 important because uh, most of the students will feel that English is one of the most important like easy section where you can get full out of full no it's not possible guys uh, be practical uh, most of the students will be losing most of the marks in english itself so coming to english what are the most important topics are concentrate on sentence improvement 
they'll give you a sentence wantedly they'll miss some word or they'll give you wantedly wrong sentence where you need to improvise the sentence so this is one of the most important uh, topic please uh, the more you practice the more marks you can get easily so sentence improvement is very important and then reading comprehension coming to the reading comprehension uh, most of the students will be wasting time uh, just by reading the entire pa paragraph or passage whatever it might be and the most other important thing which I can tell you coming to the reading comprehension is that you can score more than 8 to 10 marks uh, just by reading comprehension what you need to do is uh, coming to the reading comprehension first read the question and then start, uh, start uh, searching the related answer from the paragraph okay <coughs> excuse me don't waste your time uh, by reading the entire paragraph first read the question and then read the passage and uh, start searching the answer for the question in the paragraph uh, this is one of the most important tip i would like to give you regarding reading comprehension and then the third most important topic coming to the verbal ability or english is closed test okay closed test is very important and then sentence rearrangement or para jumbles okay so you uh, have to practice more and more the more you practice the more uh, within the less time you can happily solve the more questions para jumbles are very important okay and then analogy as usual very important and last but not least the last two are an uh, anatomy sorry i'm so sorry uh, antonyms and synonyms I'm so sorry for telling anatomy, anatomy. I'm confused. So antonyms and synonyms are very easy and important as well. The more you practice, the more you can score. Uh, uh, coming to antonyms, it's nothing but you need to find out the opposite of the given word. Coming to synonyms, you have to find the meaning of the given word, which is very important. So last but not least, uh, programming and coding. First, let's see uh, what are the things which you can see regarding the programming. Coming to the programming, what you need to do is you have to have very good knowledge about programming basic concepts as well as programming skills such as uh, most of the questions like 80% uh, of the questions how they'll be asking coming to the programming are or uh, they'll give you a program and they'll ask you what will be the output of the given program this is one kind of most common question which uh, which will be asked uh, coming to the tcs programming uh, section and then they'll ask you uh, they'll give you a program and they'll ask you what is the uh, type of error which may occur after running this program okay so such kind of basic questions will be asked what you need to do is you just need to be uh, very good at programming skills and you should have the basic knowledge of entire programming and last but not least uh, the last section is coding in which you just need to write a single program in any of the languages which you are perfect in you can write uh, the program in c c plus plus Perl, uh, python java any language as you wish and what you need to do is you have to write a program within the given time and you need to compile it you should get the uh, requested output then you can get the complete marks okay uh, coming to coding so these are the four important sections and these are the four uh, import four sections uh, important topics which i've told you and coming to the most important tips which i would like to give you is as you are just left with a one week more like you just have seven days uh, to start your exam because the exam is going to be on 1st of September 2019 what you need to do is uh, concentrate on coding and programming okay and then concentrate on uh, English okay so uh, and the second important tip is that uh, coming to aptitude please uh, start revising the important formulae so that uh, you can solve any problem within the given time uh, you need not waste your time in just thinking the the questions again and again and the third important tip uh, to the students who are going to attempt this TCS uh, exam is that 
you'll be having it's a national wide test you'll be having lacks of competitors so even a single mark matters a lot okay so please don't take the risk of guess marking the answers if you don't know just leave it okay unnecessarily uh, don't go in negative and don't uh, lose the marks which have already are in your pockets so and the fourth important tip i would like to give you is um, be at the exam center at least before one hour and make sure you carry all the important documents such as hall ticket and all and uh, why am i insisting you to be at the exam center at least, uh, at least before one hour is that uh, they are not going to allow your uh, valuables such as phone uh, all that so you will be having a clock room where you can put all your stationery there so it takes time and also there will be a form outside the exam center where you need to uh, find out your uh, name or find out your hall ticket number among thousands and thousands of the people who are going to write the exam in the very same center which you are going to write so it uh, happily you know you can you can happily run out to your run out of your time if you are uh, there at the moment uh, where within 10 minutes exam are going to be commenced where exam is going to be started so please don't take the risk of uh, running at the last time and also uh, make sure you are finding out your center at least before one day of the exam because uh, there will be many exams conducted in the very same location so uh, there will be many blocks also A, B, something like that so it's better always to find out the exam center at least one day before okay and uh, write the exam till the last second of the time don't waste your time don't just uh, quit the exam in between and don't run out of the exam hall use the entire time it's fine if you sit there till last second uh, nothing you want to lose so and most important tips are please uh, uh, keep referring the previous years papers which can really help you in order to crack this particular exam so these are the important tips and uh, important topics which I would like to uh, which I gave you in this particular video hope you found this video useful don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the bell icon for more such videos and also don't forget to uh, follow my channel best way to study for more such wonderful videos if you have any queries you can feel free to watch my uh, comment section and comment uh, your question there I'll be replying you uh, every Saturday uh, in my Saturday study talks video so all the very best for your exam uh, thanks for watching guys and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and also hit the bell icon all the best for your exam